It is a special occasion and always one to be cherished. Who will go down in history as the winners of the FA Cup? It's Manchester City, they face Liverpool, and it's coming up live on EA TV next. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Manchester City taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Emerick Laporte plays alongside John Stones in central defence. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. So the starting lineup for Liverpool. Thank you. Enjoy your day at the legendary Wembley Stadium. This should be one to savour. Manchester City get the contest underway. Grealish. Back to Haaland. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Salah, Nunez, and no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. What a shocking pass, really. De Bruyne, De Bruyne. Now with Gundogan. Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. The end product just wasn't there. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And a chance for him to nudge in front. And the keeper more than equal to it. So the corner played into the box. High class defending right on the goal line. Nunez. This is Salah. Simikas. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Stones. De Bruyne now, Holland. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Good refereeing, waiting for a natural pause before booking him. And pushed away to safety. Bonate. Here is Thiago. Elliot. 
Salah. It's got to be. And a goal. Liverpool strike first in the final. And just listen to their fans. Well, I don't think he did quite enough there. He's got a touch on it, but in the end, he can't keep it out. He won't be happy with that. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Grealish. And reading it absolutely superbly. Well, those stats don't lie. Liverpool haven't controlled the ball, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. Must be! Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Mo Salah. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Holland. Gundogan. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Salah. Will he play it in? Keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. And taken short. Thiago. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. And the referee's whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium. So back in business, and it was a breathtaking performance by Liverpool in the first 45, you've got to say. And the intervention, a good one by Stones. Can they hit on the break? Holland. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So, back in action. City still behind, but this game very much a contest. Mo Salah. Just the challenge that was required. Kevin De Bruyne. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball, but it means nothing unless they start to be more creative, particularly in the wide areas. Up to this point, they've been too easy to defend against. Well, looking to put the ball to good use here. Good work from Liverpool to make sure possession changed hands. 
Now can they counter clinically? This is Thiago. Has a go. And the keeper did more than enough. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. To be replaced by number 26, Andrew Robertson. Well, they fancy a short one. A delivery from Salah here. And a no-nonsense clearance. Bonatti. On to Konate. And is it going to be Thiago? Oh, good save. And a substitution in the offing. Can he deliver it with accuracy? It hasn't come to very much. Alexander Arnold. That's excellent defending following the cross. Jack Grealish. 20 minutes remaining. Excellent use of advantage from the referee in City's favour. Gundogan! Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel. And then the finish from Gundogan was never in doubt. He's such a good technician. taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances and space here on the flank Matty keeping the ball moving Mo Salah No damage done. A change in the offing for City. Well, Liverpool are certainly creating opportunities to take the lead here, but that was a brilliant save to deny them. Joao Cancelo. Just ten minutes remaining here. This looks threatening. Grealish. Laporte. Can he put them in front? No is the answer to the question. And that could be so important at this stage. Well, will they get another chance? That would surely have won the game for them. And taken short. De Bruyne John Stones must take the lead here oh he's been foiled how pivotal could that be at this stage of the game well it was a good save but that was the chance to win the game there that could be their last opportunity and the short option preferred Mares now with De Bruyne very quick thinking there well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Robertson. And the keeper diving to thwart him. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And he's fired over the corner. Chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets. <laughs> Not testing the keeper at all with that effort. Riyad Mahrez. Joao Cancelo. Well, they still have designs on the win.
They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Well, the ball rolling again, no end to the action. It's the first period of extra time, and I must say, this has been a back and forth type of game. Coming off the pitch, number six, Thiago, to be replaced by number eight. Plenty of support here. Walker. On to Grealish. Textbook defending inside the box. Nunez. Mati. This attack looks highly promising, but timely defending when it mattered. Breaking at pace. Defenders need to cover. Grealish. And he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Darwin Nunez. Henderson. An incisive pass. Oh, and the decision is penalty. A big chance for them to take the lead here. And into the book he goes too. Well, once he gave the penalty, he was always going to give him a yellow card. Now to restore their lead here. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. Well, that's it for the first period of extra time. Let's see what the second has in store. And so the drama continues here. We're into the second period of extra time. Henderson, really good high press. And in! Oh yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker, and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Henderson! He's showing a real will to win the ball. Naby Keita. Matty. And the corner for Liverpool. Played over. Pumped clear. Alexander Arnold.
penalty. Well cleared away. Well, he was being pressed, but did his job. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yep, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition. And so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.